Welcome to Business Profile on TV3. I'm Joel Kecky. We're at Steve Sanitation in Perm. I'm here with co-owner and president, Kelly Melgard. Kelly, as we talk about Steve Sanitation, a company that's been around a long time, tell us about the history of Steve Sanitation. Uh, the company was uh, originally purchased by my parents, Steve and Kay, in 1986 from Larry Brazel in Perm here. At that time, it was a uh, one-man Two truck operation. Um, since then, we've grown some and acquired a acquired a company in New York Mills in 2004. And in 2017, we acquired a company in Detroit Lakes um, to expand our service area and continue to offer the lowest possible ser lowest possible price on our services that we can. Kelly, you talked about some of the acquisitions. Exactly where does Steve Sanitation, as far as the service area, where do you guys go? Uh, we run uh, in Ottertail and Becker County. Um, Becker County all the way over to Lake Park, um, from Wolf Lake to Lake Park. Yes. Um, Ottertail County, uh, Perm over to Bluffton, uh, down to Battle Lake, around Ottertail, um, main Amor area. We talk about services that you provide. Uh, most people think of it just as garbage or refuse, but Steve Sanitation has a wide variety of services that they offer their customers. We offer uh, residential garbage pickup, uh, commercial garbage pickup with our garbage trucks. Uh, we offer single sort recycling in, in certain locations. Um, we offer roll-off services for waste at large facilities with compactors. Uh, for demolition, for construction remodels, new construction, um, roll-offs for uh, specialty waste removals. Kelly, technology is prevalent in all of our businesses today, but in your business, uh, technology has kind of changed the way that people not only look at refuse and recycling, but the way that you guys actually collect garbage. Yeah, we've uh, one thing we've done is we've implemented a tablet-based system for our routing, so we're able to track everything. We're able to see when we were at the stops, uh, easily answer questions for customers when they call in. We've, uh, we've also, where we take our waste to is the local incinerator. There they have done an expansion where they are removing uh, certain recyclables before it is sent to the incinerator. Uh, another thing that, uh, that we've just recently gotten into is automated, fully automated trucks. So the driver does not have to get out of the truck uh, for a residential pickup. Uh, the truck does all the work itself. It's all run with a joystick and it's great technology when it works. Finally, uh, something you guys kind of unique you guys are doing, it's called Kick Cancer to the Curb. People may have seen the pick uh, garbage receptacles around the hour. Tell us about that program. It, uh, it's program, the uh, company we purchased from Detroit Lakes had started it, and we thought it was a great program, so we decided to continue it. When we purchase the carts from the manufacturer, they uh, donate $5 from each cart purchased to the American Cancer Society Breast Cancer Awareness Program. Um, for us, uh, for end users, if customers would like them, uh, we ask for a minimum of a $25 donation. If it's in Ottertail County, that money is donated to Lakeland Hospice and earmarked for cancer care. If it's Becker County, it's donated to Red River Valley Hospice and earmarked for cancer care. Kelly, uh, for folks who want to contact you, maybe find out about the services that you offer, whether it's residential or commercial, how can people get in touch with you? They can go to our website. It's stevesanitation.com. There's two S's in the middle of that. Um, they can call us, 218-346-4834. Uh, they can also send an email to support at stevesanitation.com. And you guys are also on Facebook, correct? Correct. All right, sounds great. We're here with uh, Kelly Melgard, Steve Sanitation in Perm. I'm Joel Ketke for TV3.